welcome to George's Hall Anglican Church Online. Thank you for joining us today. They're important, aren't they, those two little words, thank you. Some psychologists say that being grateful gives you a positive emotional state and helps you cope with stress. It can improve your mental health and even your physical health. It certainly strengthens relationships. When you say thank you, you let the other person know you value what they've done for you. And maybe that'll encourage them to help you again in the future. When people don't say thank you, it really grates, even for a simple thing like opening a door for them. It's worse if the person has done you a big favour. Anne and I enjoy watching Bondi Rescue. Most people thank the lifeguards for saving them. Sometimes they come back the next day with a gift to express their appreciation. Now, of course, the lifeguards don't do their job for the thanks, but they're a little upset when occasionally their patients walk away without any acknowledgement that someone just saved their life. If it's important to thank other people for the things they do for us, it is most important to thank God for all that he has done for us. He's done so much for us. Well, let's pause for a moment and think about the things we can thank God for. If you're watching this with others, pause the video and have a chat about it. There's lots to thank God for, isn't there? I hope you included God's kindness in saving us. Well, let's thank God together right now. I invite you to say this thanksgiving to God with me. Almighty God and merciful Father, we give you humble and hearty thanks for all your goodness and loving kindness to us and to all people. We praise you for creating and sustaining us and for all the blessings of this life but above all, for your amazing love in redeeming the world through our Lord Jesus Christ, giving us grace and the hope of glory. Give us such a sense of all your goodness, that we may be truly thankful, and may praise you not only with our lips, but in our lives, by serving you in holy and righteous ways. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, to whom with you and the Holy Spirit be all honour and glory, now and for ever. Amen. We'll see you after this song for some more prayer and Bible reading.